Let's head down now to Bradenton, where Marco Villarreal is standing by for us. And Marco, we understand that the county is already helping people there get ready? They are, Chris Avery. Good morning. They just declared a state of a local state of emergency here in Manatee County. That goes along with the state's order that came out uh, just a couple days ago, and that's why they've opened up a sandbag location out here where people can come and get their fill of sandbags here at this location. It's the uh, public works spot in Bradenton. Starting in just a few hours, their emergency operations center is going to activate to a level two activation. Manatee County 311 call center will be open today despite the holiday to answer calls about the sandbag locations and or preparing for the storm. Public safety officials are worried since we have already seen a lot of rain and the ground is saturated. Trees could topple easier with those tropical storm winds and they're urging all residents to do what they recommended at the start of hurricane season. Make a plan now. We do expect it to be an active hurricane season. And if you make a plan now, when we do call for evacuations and we get prepared for a storm coming, you'll be in a much better place. All right, so again, as of right now, Manatee County not expecting to have to declare any evacuations, but they want people to be prepared. That's why they've got the sandbag locations here with the shovels. Uh, all you have to do starting at 8 o'clock this morning, you come out here and they have bags uh, where you can stop by. Grab up to 10 per household, then you fill them up with your sand and then take them over to your home. Now, regarding Sarasota County, they do not have any sandbag locations open right now. They say, though, they are monitoring Elsa. And so if we have any updates from them, we'll make sure to update you right here on News Channel 8 today. Reporting live in Bradenton, Marco Villarreal, 8 on your side.